Hello, Internet. My name is Dakota with Northern Knives, and I'm here to talk to you about an exciting new ProTech, I mean, uh, Flytanium knife from their Arcform brand. Stay tuned, we'll get into the details. <laughs> So new auto from Argform. Made by Protec. Made by Protec. Owned by Flytanium, which is so sort a lot of fun. Of, a lot of hands in the pot here, you know. Yeah. Let's not hit each other when we open these. Swing. Nice. All right. So they definitely fire like a Protec. They do. The handle design, it the whole thing is reminiscent of a Malibu, except it's an auto. To an extent, I can see the, the similarities, I suppose. You suppose? Yeah. I mean, I suppose. simple and well made, which I appreciate. Yeah. I mean, kind of like the Malibu in that mm -hmm. respect. Yep. And then they do the two slab scales, which have the nice little seam down the middle. Open back, which is nice for lint. Mm-hmm. I like the two-tone. Yeah, oh, it's yeah. A nice blade That's on why that. I really Purple like this. Apocalyptic finish with the yeah. satin two-tone. Is that what they call it? Or is that copyrighted? Apocalyptic what? finish? I think other people do like a dark acid wash or whatever. Yeah, I mean, it's I, what it is. <laughs> I don't I think that's cool. I don't think you can trademark a finish name. Does that have a false top grind to it? Uh, yeah, it's just like a it's another extra little, little grind. Yeah. And that's got a little extra little grind on the end mm -hmm. to a completely blunt tip. So, you know, you can't stab someone unless <clears throat> you're really trying. You can't that, slice them. That blade shape's all the rage these days, you know? Mm -hmm. I mean, this is the best box <clears throat> cutter ever. We'll be up there. Do you there. have one? No, but I want one. They are 154CM, which is not my favorite, but... I mean, for the price point, 160, 170, yeah, and, uh, 135. Perfect. Did they do a good heat treat on it? They do. You know? Yes. So it'll, People it'll will always enjoy their 154 cm. Yeah. Is it? They just get a few extra points of hardness out of it, or they do some sort of special? I heat don't treat? honestly know what they do. I don't. Yeah. I think they do it in house. I really don't know. Um, I feel like Mike would know because he's talked to Dave about heat treated and CNC and stuff. But I don't know. All I know is that for what it is, it performs well. I do like that their their clip is actually recessed. Recessed, and I, then it uses two instead of one screws, which is kind of nice. I do and don't like that because if your clip wears on that aluminum because it's a little softer, it's yeah. not going to stay ever again. Okay. Now, why are these? So, Arcform is Flytanium's knife brand, right? Mm-hmm. So, why is the Balasong their first knife when I think these came out before? <clears throat> I don't know, maybe because... Their first in-house knife? It might be. Well, the Talisong is Flytanium. Yeah. These are art form. There you go. That's why. Yeah. Okay. Thank so you. So it's like you can buy... Brain things. You can buy a <laughs> Ford, or you can buy a Lincoln, or you can buy a Mercury. Yeah. It's all... Why would you buy a Mercury? <laughs> it's 2022, people. Yeah. Come yeah. on. Sorry. It's okay. Mercuries are awesome. All plastic. I... <laughs> <laughs> I don't think I know anybody that owns a Mercury. I know lots of people who own Mercuries. I know people who have owned, but currently I don't think I do. Yeah, they're they're vintage at this point. Mm. Vintage the ones. Nice. But I don't know. Overall, they're pretty cool. You get what appears to be uh, almost automatic Malibu, almost Malibu automatic, and you get that really cool blade profile. You get the little Protec logo in there, so you know it's that that super stealth swag. I mean, if you like the blade shape. And you need an auto, you can go into this now and you're going to get ProTech quality. Yep. You know, it's good stuff. Yeah, and they're, they're sub uh, $200, so like mm -hmm. they range anywhere from like I think 169 up to like 199 depending on what spec you get. The operator is over $200, so with the tritium mm -hmm. button and then all blacked out. And there are a bunch of other variations I've got ordered. I don't know when they're showing up. But I, I do remember seeing like a handful of different variations and just ordering some. So... Yeah. There are more out there. I think there's some fancy ones, too. I'll have to look and see. I want to see what other blade shapes and handle designs they have. I don't think there's any different blade shapes, but I think there's different, like, handle types and maybe, like, a Damascus one and different color ones nice. or wood inlays. Yeah. I honestly don't remember. We I ordered these six months ago. It's been a little know. bit, yeah. Yeah. I feel like folks go to ProTac and just be like, yo, bro, I need a knife. And he's like, I got you, fam. 
Well, and they just make great make something. <laughs> yeah. And it's like, okay, well, we got this program. Let's just like <laughs> tweak it here, tweak it, tweak it here, and little cost savings with the materials. Yeah, and bam, the machine doesn't work. Well, they have manuals that are very similar to these that I'm sure they make themselves. But for the autos, like you know what, why not go to Protec? Mm-hmm. Okay. Protec does it well. Yeah. I well, I mean, overall, what do you think of the knife? I like it. Yeah. I think it's a pretty clean, simple knife. Ooh, we should get copper scales to shipwreck it. That is fun. I like that a lot. <laughs> Might be difficult, but. You know, well, Mike I can the, just hit I a few the, buttons on the CNC yeah, and bam. Yeah, it's done. Yeah. The machine does all the work. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> or maybe Flytanium makes scales for their own knives. There's a cute little Ewok over there dancing around. He's went. <laughs> yeah, he's, <laughs> he's cheesed on us. Yep, he did. Baby bear.